Good morning, welcome to my channel. What I want to touch on today is economics and economy. What I mean by that is the time we're in right now, this is the time to be very, very cautious with your money. Please do not be squandering your money. Don't throw your money away on unnecessary things. This is the time you think very hard before you spend. Because, I mean, the money that you have, you're going to need. So, you know, put a little money aside. And if you have money in the bank, take some of it out of the bank and put it away in your house somewhere or wherever you want to put it. But, because you never know what could happen with these banks. The banks could crash. Everything could be shut down. You know, you, want, you just want to play it safe right now. You want to play it safe and you want to play it smart. Because you don't want to get caught with your pants down. Yeah, so this is what I'm saying. The economics and the economy is busted right now. Yeah, it's busted, man. It's like we're going down a real slippery slope right now. Downhill. And I'm just talking to my people. I'm just letting y'all know, man. Just be careful with how you spend right now. And always keep something aside emergency funds that you can put your hand on at any given time. Yes, the emergency funds. And you know, another thing, do as less driving as you have to. You know, seeing how high this gas prices and things are going, man. You don't want to be driving your car around unnecessarily. If you have errands to run, do it early in the morning if you possibly can you know before it's a lot of traffic out there see once you get <laughs> this, the traffic gets busy you don't want to be out there getting stuck in traffic You're burning a lot of gas yeah you want to save on everything possibly right now that you can save on you don't want to you know you don't want to do anything that's unnecessary because right now everything is tight budgets are tight man you know we have to be careful Yes, we have to be very, very careful right now how we do everything. I mean, when you're going out grocery shopping, make sure you look at things real good before you buy. Just don't buy the highest thing that you see in the store. Check the prices out on everything. Yeah. See, in this day, in this day and time now, we have to, you know, we have to save as much as we can, man, as much as possible. You know, we got to think smart, we got to be smart. Yes, like I said, do as less driving as possible. You do your errands during the daytime while it's not a lot of traffic going on, you know. Don't try to get out there at rush hour during the evening because you're burning more gas because you're stopping and going, stopping and going, you're in traffic. Yes, be careful, folks. Just, you know, try to think smart. Yes, please, try to think smart. I mean, just don't be going out here spending unnecessary money. Please, this is not the time to do that. This is not the time to be spending a lot of unnecessary money. This is the time to be putting away things for the hard times to come. Yes. You know, get you a couple of things here and there that you need. You don't have to buy a lot of things if you, all at once. You know, just get here, there, here, there, here, there. Just pick up things you need. Here, there, get something here now. Maybe you get something next week. You know, maybe a week after. And you'll come back the next week and pick up something else. You know, this is how you have to do it, little by little. Just make sure you get things in order. Yes. Like I said, man, this economy is busted, man. We're going downhill fast, fast as lightning. I just want all my people to be prepared, man. That's it. Yes. And I want everybody to stay safe out there, man. Stay safe. Keep your eyes open. Use your money wisely in this time that we're in. Use it very wisely. 
Yeah, because we, we're not going to get any help from anyone. So we're going to have to do for ourselves, man. We're going to have to keep our own lives in order. In proper perspectives. Yes. This is what we're going to have to do, folks. But like I said, you know, do as less driving as possible. You know, just don't be riding around randomly doing nothing. Just to be burning gas because gas is too high. Man. I know here in my city it's five dollars a gallon now. Hmm. Hey, but I, you know, I thank God that I had the money to, to put gas in my car, you know. Yeah. I mean, as, as long as God blessed me to put money in my, I mean, gas in my car, I got to give him thanks for it. I'm just thankful for everything that the, that the Lord does for me, you know. I'm thankful. Yes. Yeah, yeah, we got to, you know, we got to know how to move out here in these streets right now, man. You gotta know how to move, you gotta know how to spend, you gotta know how to do everything properly in a proper perspective. Yes, you can't just be doing things aimlessly, just throwing money away like, you know, no, this is not the time. Not the time, folks. Please do the right thing. Get yourself together, get things in order, get things stocked up. You know, if you have any uh, empty gas, you know, the gas cans, you know, fill two or three of those up and put them in your basement, you know, or put them outside somewhere, you know, just to keep them in case you run out of gas or something, you know. So you always have to think smart. You have to think two steps or three steps ahead, man. You got to look down the road. Just don't live for today because you got to see what's going, going, going on way down the road. Yes, oh yeah. But I thought I would just get on here and touch on a couple of things. You know, try to help my people out there. Keep them updated. Yeah, man, it's the economy and this stuff is... Like I said, man, inflation is coming, man. Yes. So, folks, if y'all like this commentary, stay tuned.